It's your favorite YouTube dealer. I appreciate you guys for stopping in. And Glorb might be everybody's favorite AI voiceover rapper. This man is disgustingly good. And I still haven't went back and watched that interview because I think he did one with Charlie, was it? I want to say Charlie talked to him on his channel. And I've been meaning for the longest time to go and watch that, and I still haven't. So this is my reminder. When my man dropped something called Ocean's Eleven, I was looking for some stuff to react to today. Token is dropping something new, which I'm excited for. And I saw this pop up, and I knew we had to dive into it. So let's get into it. Let's see what this man's cooking with. SpongeBob, me boy. Where's all me money? And where's the customers? Ah, uh, relax, Krabs. I've got a plan. We just need to hit Dankton where it hurts. Squiddy, I know for a fact that that puff bitch is watching those camera tapes. As soon as Krabs, <laughs> Pat, and I hit the casino and start gambling, put that shit on loop so we can find a way into the vault. Oh, and gang, word is that Dennis the Don is now head of security. Watch out for his bitch ass. Yeah, okay, SpongeBob. So basically you want to do it Ocean's Eleven, huh? I then fuck it. Let's go! Oh, dang, this man always got some catchy hooks. I also like the little plays on Kane. Like, I'm assuming cocaine. I got to go back and listen to it again. But obviously, Kane and Abel. I'm Abel. Ab yes, yeah, so that, that's actually dope. L little shit like that adds a lot to songs. But this man's hook game is on point. Let's go! Yep. The casino plays. Yo, my man SpongeBob. Wait, hold up. <laughs> my man got the grill on his two front teeth. I love it. I love it. But yeah, also the the casino plays. The Russian roulette. The uh, what what else did he say? He said something else that was it was also related necessarily to a, a casino shit. Heart spade. Tables. Russian roulette. Money. Look at my man got the grill, the ice grill. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, I said, I like when he adds in shit like that. First of all, shout out to Mark Rober. For anybody that does not know, you should look that man's channel up. He has some amazing content. I want to say there was one that he did with like, was it him that did the squirrel one? Where like the squirrels were, I, I can't recall now if that was him or not. But either way, what he referenced is the 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 what do they what, what do they call them? Porch pirates, the people that come onto your 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 property and they try to steal your packages and shit like that. I think he had it happen to him once, and so we started to create fake packages that would record what was going on, had like a glitter bomb in it, and all sorts of just madness. And people would steal it. He would track where it went, and they'd have the cameras on it that they couldn't disable to see what actually happened when they would open it and it would go off. Like, that shit was so genius. Like, that man is so good at what he does. You've got to show his channel some love. See, this not a garbage, it's a cobra. Had to shut him down, snake skin on my lover. Popped him like a glitter bomb, but Mark Rover. Cut him melanoma, bleeding like a donor. Fought him like a sulfur, cause I've been overheading, overseeing like a vulture. And I've been making bread and burning off his with that toaster, yeah. <laughs> the pink cheek clapper. Yo, let's go. Bro, this man has so many little references. Nardwar being probably one of the greatest interviewers at finding stuff that nobody knows. Every interview he does, there's something that he asks where the person is like, how the hell did you find that out? And nobody's ever asked it before. It's crazy. I don't know how he does it. Oh, oh, they do it. I'm a stupid bitch. No, oh, keep my fucking name at 
to mouth like the hard art. Okay, let it bang, don't slang, <laughs> making paper. Gang got the cane that we wouldn't, we able. Gang hit his heart with the spade, having tables. Gang, we not brushing it through, live on in the chamber. Our money. Yeah, fuck it. Run your wallet, yeah. Money. Yeah, fuck it. Show your pocket, yeah. Money. Yeah, fuck it. We come from it, yeah. Money. Yeah, fuck it. Hey, yo, Spurs, what we doing with our fans? We gon' fucking throw it up, make our money, crib or blood. Let's go kill them like I tell it, spend their money, man, Lord. Fuck up, fall out, we gon' run. How much you smoking? Mega times, yeah. <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Yo, what about the money? We gon' throw it up. Crip of blood, like, yo, like gang signs, and then, yeah, the fallout reference I kind of missed because I was thinking more about the shit that he had just said. Yo, pocket, yeah. Money. Yeah, fuck it. We from money, yeah. Money. Yeah, fuck it. We from hundreds of ass. Hey, yo, Spurs, what we doing with our fans? We gon' fucking throw it up, make our money, crib or blood. Let's go kill them like I tell it, spend their money, you mean not. Fuck up, fall out, we gon' run. How much you smoking? Mega times, <laughs> yeah, I got the stick, I got the switch, I ain't dubbing. I let it hit his eye, I, 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 I run a ship, I catch and crit, I needle prick, I see I'm dripping, I, 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 I. Yes, Mr. Top Scholar, fuck your fat daughter, be my top dog <laughs> since I... Yo, F your thought dollar, or daughter dot dollar. Holy shit, I messed it all up. I messed it all up. I ain't swearing say the F word though, because in a song, the algorithm seems, not even the algorithm, the automated system seems to let it slide. But if I pause and I start swearing, they're suddenly like, yo, whoa, 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 whoa. It's not suitable for ads. We can't be, we can't be doing all this. So I got to be careful. Okay, I thought it was over. I'm like, no, no, keep going. I wish we had a whole other verse, to be honest with you. Yo, that was fun. That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. I like how we used the, the, the Ocean's Eleven concept. I think that's an amazing movie. I said this about a lot of things in this. If you haven't seen it, if you haven't done that, go check it out. Ocean's Eleven was fire. I liked all the other movies as well, but I'd say like the first one or two were probably the best. But I think all of them were a good watch, to be completely honest. So I think it's dope that he played on that. A lot of references in this, not even just with people, but just little things. Like towards the end, I didn't stop for it. The whole something about a dog ever since I popped my collar, collar. You know what I mean? Like it's just a lot of little connections and little intricacies within his writing that I think is fire and adds a lot to it. On top of the fact that he just makes some vibey music. Like, really good, catchy shit and stuff that just you could just nod to. It's a bop, basically. and and But it has a lot of content and substance to it at the same time. And then, obviously, add in the fun AI voiceovers and all that kind of shit. It's genius. This this man has a great formula for what he does. And I'm happy that it's working. Get that bag. That shit is fire. Uh, I'm going to have to watch that interview with him and Charlie, without a doubt. Quick plug, if anybody wants to, uh, you know, stop in. I should be live today. Twitch.tv slash Dwayne TV. I've been playing through the Elden Ring DLC. It's just hard. Shit's hard. Never played any Dark Souls games. Played the original Elden Ring and beat it. And now I'm playing through this. I've had some struggles, but for the most part, I've overcome it. I think I got two main bosses, but I want to fight a whole bunch of the optional bosses that I haven't seen yet. So I got to go looking for them. But anybody that wants to stop in, that's where we are. Friday and Saturday is usually music stream on the Twitch. But throughout the week, we game and do whatever the hell comes up. So just letting you know. But I appreciate you. Take it easy. Stay safe. I'll catch you in the next one, homie.